Okay, troops, are you ready? We got nine after nine. Here he is, the New York Juice Report, the one and only Chuck Chill. Hello, UK. This is the Chill with the Electro Juice out of the Big Apple. A lot of misinformed people around the U.S. have predicted rap's decline, citing less and less success on the rap front. My reply to those rapophobics is bull. I base my educative rebuttal on the fact that hip-hoppers like Run DMZ and Houdini, veterans of the rap army, are having mega success on record and on the road. Everywhere their current tour plays is a sellout. In addition to Run DMC and Houdini, the tour features LL Cool J, the Beastie Boys, and the Time Next Social Club. Due in New York next week, playing Madison Square Garden, tickets are harder to get than snowballs in the summer. When I asked Run recently what he thinks about the tales of rap's decline, he said, Man, I've been hearing that crap since me, DMC, and Jam Master J made it. There ain't nothing to it but a lot of old people who never like rap anyway and young ones who don't know a thing about being fresh. <laughs> Way to go, Run. Changing the subject, I wanted to know what Run DMC fans were going to get once the superstar rappers got to Madison Square Garden. Run wraps it up by saying they're coming in raising hell, which just so happens to be the name of their now platinum-selling latest album. I mean, just because the guy is from the streets doesn't mean he doesn't know how to plug his record. <laughs> there has been less and less talk about violence at rap concerts lately. Now, I bring that up because there has been more and more reports of young people taking crack, the lethal cocaine-based drug ravaging inner city youth across America. Maybe crackheads are spending so much of their cash on drugs they can't afford to go to the concerts. Anyway, Dougie Fresh told me his new record entitled Nothing, the flip side of All the Way to Heaven, that heavy tune that has that hip uh, trumpet solo in it, is really an anti-crack rap. Then he surprised us by saying two of his friends have died from crack-related incidents. UK people out there, please, if you get the opportunity to snort, blow, or whatever, some crack, stay away from it. It's death, okay? You know, Fresh has been named the New York State spokesman against crack and will be doing radio, television, and print ads for the anti-crack campaign. It's really something how Doug, who just a few months ago seems almost uh, has been, bounced back with a hit single, new album, and revitalized career. The brother must be doing something right. Oh, yeah, his debut album is called... Oh, my God. <laughs> Slick Rick, Slick Rick, where are you? The Wall Street Journal, the weekly tabloid of the financial set, has voted Russell Simmons, president of Russ Productions, home of Run DMC, Houdini, and Curtis Blow, among others, the mogul of rap. Somebody better tell them that's old news. Got some mail from some of you chillites congratulating me on the birth of my twin boys, Rashawn and Rashad, who are getting much fatter and louder these days. One is 10 pounds, 10 ounces. The other is 10 pounds, 14 ounces. And, you know, I'm grooming them to be the first of the world's first set of twin infant rappers. <laughs> Thanks to Clemency, Otto of London for the pretty card, and Casey K and the UBA from Essex. Your letter was great. And to answer some, just a few of your questions, that is, homeboy, yes, I'm coming to UK Fresh. I'll be there with the real Roxanne. No, it's nothing like that, Casey. We're just good friends, and I'll be helping her meet some of the press over there. No, Just Ice and Joski Love are not saying something to me in their records. It's another guy, a DJ by the name of Chuck Chillout. But not to worry. He's chill out. I'm chill in. In regards to the questions about Mantronics, well, they're not nearly as hot in America as they are in the UK, but every day they're getting more and more popular at home. So Mix-A-Lot is also much more happening in England than American Casey. And as far as your inquiry about hip-hop changing into heavy metal on the basis of some of the heavy metal elements in a few new rap records, hey, let's hope not. It's just that every now and then rap, like all music, needs a breath of fresh air to keep it going. It's about deaf beats and rhymes. That's what makes rap rap. Anything else is just window dressing, including heavy metal. Hey, I'd like to answer some of your questions, too, so send them care of me to Mike Allen at Capitol Radio.
Hey, that's all for now. If everything goes according to plan, I'll be speaking to you live from London next week at UK Fresh. Keep killing, crew. Now, here's the freshest DJ in the UK, my main homeboy, and broski, Mike Allen. Chuck Till with this week's New York Juice Report. You'll catch him at Fresh next Saturday. Make sure you're there. You know what the man said, be there or be forgotten.